contribution to employee insurance scheme it is nothing but on the basis of wages or on the basis of the number of employees repairs to plan depreciation to plan both comes under value of plan to A warm welcome to Anand All. This is your Anand Sir here, lecturing with the Ashram First Grade College, the Temple of Excellence. And now we are discussing your Session Three, Unit Five of your Cost Accounting. Under Cost Accounting, we are discussing the topic called Overhead. In the previous session, we discussed one topic on overhead, and we worked out one problem on overhead. In the same case we'll work out one more problem this is also your examination problem so very important for your examination purpose and as i told you there are two types are there one will be primary distribution and one more is secondary distribution what we did in the previous session it is primary distribution and what we are going to do in today's session that is also primary distribution once you done with the primary distribution next session will go with secondary distribution so that we can complete your topic called overhead your problem number 2 in this the modern company is divided into four departments a b and c are production department and d is a service department total how many departments are there four in this a b c all three called as department one one it is nothing but production department and d we have this we call it as service department production department is over and service department also over in this now rent of rupees 10000 repairs to plant 6000 depreciation to plant 4500 lighting is 1000 these are called as expenditure these are called as expenditure now plant 10000 Uh, repairs to plant six thousand, depreciation of plant four thousand five hundred. This is rent and lighting is one thousand. One, two, three, four. Total how many expenses are over? Total four expenses are over. Then once you done with these four, what is the next procedure? Yes, supervision is fifteen thousand. What is the next one? Supervision charges. It is fifteen thousand. Insurance is five thousand. Power rupees nine thousand. Another three expenses we got: supervision charges, insurance, as well as power charges. Then, employers' contribution to employee insurance scheme thousand five hundred. Like insurance policy, employers to employee. Now. How many expenses are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Total, we got eight expenses. Is it enough? No. These are the expenses are there. These are paid by whom? Paid by one, two, three, four, four members, four department. How much they should pay? How much? Like rent ten thousand. Out of ten thousand, how much should paid by Y? How much should paid by B? How much should paid by C? And how much should paid by D? You cannot do equally. Like ten thousand divided by one, two, three, four. You cannot do. Why? Because assume that he has taken this much space. This person has taken only this much space. He has taken only this much. He has taken this much. Then what happens? Rent varies. Everybody cannot come equal. Hope you are clear. Everybody cannot come under equal slab. Then what happens? According to their area usage, we are supposed to do the calculation. Hope you are clear. Yes. Now these are the calculations are done. Employees insurance scheme everything is done. Now we have to go for allocation. Like. Rent on the basis of what floor area? How much each used? And your plant depreciation is on the basis of what? On the basis of your value of the plant. 
and you are lighting on the basis of what lighting point and your supervision on the basis of number of employees insurance in on the basis of value of the plant or if insurance on stock value of this stock contribution to employee insurance scheme it is nothing but on the basis of wages or on the basis of the number of employees now we'll go for that these are the information we have we have area used by a b c d similarly number of employees given total wages see they have given employee insurance insurance is issued on the basis of what wages similarly value of plant value of stock insurance also there you can go for value of stock now all the informations we have all the bifurcations also we have then we have to go for apportion the cost to the various department on the cost equitable basis now all everything is has to be distributed according to what equitable basis means like you know that rent on the basis of floor area that is called equitable basis concerned based on you are supposed to do now we'll go for the answer before you go to the answer what you are supposed to do working note follow the same step what you are supposed to do working note what is a working note we have all the information yes make it simple how 20 15 10 5 can you make it simple yes you take the table of 5 5 1s 5 2 5 3s and 5 4s so what will be your answer now 1 is to 2 is to 3 is to 4 that is your answer 4 plus 3 7 7 plus 2 9 9 plus 1 your answer is 10 hope you are clear good like this you are supposed to work out your calculations now so we'll go one by one we'll simplify in this see you have 15000 11000 9000 5000 can you simplify this yes how do you simplify simple method i'll tell you just follow the zeros zeros 3 3 3 3 everywhere we have three zeros you can cancel three zeros Three, three, three. All the three zeros are cancelled. Done. Now, once you cancelled all the zeros, what you are supposed to do? Still, you are supposed to simplify. How do you simplify? In this, you are supposed to simplify fifteen. In the fifteen, you are supposed to simplify like fifteen. Which table you can take? Fifteen only you can take directly. Eleven, nine. Five. Why you did not simplify it again? Why? Because five, nine, eleven, fifteen. You cannot take in a single table. You cannot go with single table. That's why this will be the final answer. Over. Yes. You have number of employees twenty, fifteen, ten, five. Already I told you. You can take from the five table one, two, three, four. Over. Yes. Finally, I suppose to total also then twenty thousand, thirty thousand, forty thousand, sixty thousand. What is common in all? Four zeros are common. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All the four zeros are common. Then what happens? Two will remain as it is. Three, four, six. Over. Can you do it again, or can we do it? Can we simplify again? We'll see. Two, three, four, six. Two, four, six can be divisible by single table, but you cannot take this three. That's why stop it there itself. All four should go by single table. If it is not possible, stop there itself. Now, two lakh forty, one lakh eighty, one lakh twenty, sixty. What is common in this four zeros? One, two, three, four. One two three four. One two three four. One two three four. Cancel, 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 cancel. Clear. Now you have six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four. Six ones are six two. Six threes are six fours. Clear. Can you simplify again? 
The answer is no. Why? Because one already you got. You cannot divide again. Now, similarly, you have one lakh fifty, ninety thousand, sixty thousand, nil. So, what is common here? Four zeros are common. Cancel, cancel, cancel. Fifteen nine six two. So you can go with the table three. Three two is a three. Three is a three. Five is a fifteen. Hope you got yes. Now add everything. Five plus three eight. Eight plus two ten. So your answer is ten. Up to this, any doubt? Hope there is no doubt. Yeah. We have done with all these things. Production department, the calculations are done. In this, what happens? Everything is we have completed in this. Once you done with the working note, then you have to go for the real answer. What is the real answer? This is your real answer. What is the heading? Apportionment of overhead, primary distribution of overhead. What you are doing now? It is only primary distribution. You are not doing secondary distribution. You are doing only what? Primary distribution. Now. As per this, as per this, you have to write all the expenses given in the question. Now, what are the expenses are given in the question? We'll go for that. We have rent, repairs, depreciation, lighting, one, two, three, four. Then supervision charges, insurance, power. And employee contribution to employment insurance scheme. Similarly, rent, repairs, depreciation, lighting, supervision, insurance, power, and the last one, employee is contribution to employees insurance scheme. Hope you are clear. We have written all the expenses. Now, what you are supposed to do? Just see what is the amount. Ten thousand, six thousand, four thousand five hundred, one thousand, fifteen thousand, five thousand, thousand five hundred. In the answer, right? Ten thousand, six thousand, four thousand five hundred, one thousand, fifteen thousand, five thousand, and nine thousand. Hope you are clear. Good. Once you done, you know that. Rent comes under what area occupied? Take area occupied. What is the calculation under area? Go back to working note. In this, fifteen, eleven, nine, five. In the working note, you will get your bifurcation. Now, so in this, what happens? Fifteen, eleven, nine, five. So go to your answer. Fifteen, eleven, nine, five. Take your answer. Whatever you have done, working note. You take numbers from the working note. Calculated for value of plant also. Take from the working note value of plant. Four, three, two, one. Clear? Yes. So everywhere you write down the total also, so that it is easy to calculate. Assume that the total is twenty six thirty five. Forty seven. The total is ten, and it is twenty six. And this one is nine area occupied. So it is again forty seven nine. It is ten eight. It is ten seven nine. It is ten. The total is very important because the base calculation we take the total. Now, if you do the calculation. Your total is how much? Ten thousand. So here you are supposed to do ten thousand multiplied with fifteen divided by forty. Similarly, ten thousand multiplied with eleven divided by forty. Ten thousand multiplied with nine divided by forty. Then ten thousand. Multiplied with five divided by forty. This much only your calculation. Hope you are clear. I'll show you the calculation for second one also. Rest you can do it yourself. We have four is to three is to two is to one. In this, what happens? What is the answer? Six thousand multiplied with four divided by ten. 
सिक्स थाउजेंड मल्टीप्लाइड विथ थ्री डिवाइड बाई टेन सिक्स थाउजेंड मल्टीप्लाइड विथ टू डिवाइड बाई टेन सिक्स थाउजेंड मल्टीप्लाइड विथ वन डिवाइड बाई टेन होप यू आर क्लियर एस दिस ऑल अबाउट यू आर सपोज टू do similarly calculate for depreciation calculate for lighting and calculate for your supervision everything you are supposed to do like this only in this depreciation of plant value of plant only we take same thing like 4 is to 3 is to 2 is to 1 that's why we have written do means it is nothing but as it is what you have taken for value of repairs to plant <laughs> Repairs to plant, depreciation to plant, both comes under value of plant only. Once you are done with this, add everything, including your employees. Your total is fifty-two, twenty-one, fifteen thousand, ten thousand, five thousand. Hope you are clear. Yes. Now, so these are all about your calculation. These are the note. I it is not required actually. Only your calculation, your working note. That is. More than sufficient. I'll go back to all your previous slide. Please take screenshot of all those. So this is your problem number two, and your solution part. This is also your question. Your working note, nothing but solution. Your actual solution. Your answer. So this is all about your today's session. Hope you understood what is overhead. In the next session, we don't do only the overhead. We also go for the allocation, primary as well as secondary. Both will work out in the next session. Thank you.